Typhoon Haiyan has finally arrived. This amateur footage showing its impact in Tagloban City. Across the Philippines, there are already many reports of power cuts and roofs being blown away. Communications are out in many areas. In Leyte State, the governor tweeted that there were problems transporting relief due to fallen trees blocking highways and main roads. Weather forecasters say it is the strongest storm to hit the planet this year. Wind gusts are in the region of 300 kilometers an hour. Preparations have been underway for days. Emergency crews have been deployed in force. And many people are hoping that will help keep damage to a minimum. Amongst them is President Benino Noino Aquino, who urged mass evacuations and the use of military aircraft and ships. The authorities know that although more than 20 other storms have battered the country this year, this will be the worst. We were expecting the typhoon to weaken a bit when it hit land at 4 in the morning, but it has maintained its strength at 235 kilometers per hour maximum sustained winds. The island of Bohol is still recovering from being at the epicenter of an earthquake just three weeks ago. That killed 200 people and forced 5,000 from their homes. Cutting trees down is just one way to minimize further damage. In Tacloban, the dangers of this typhoon are already clearly evident. And it's not just the Philippines that are in its path. So too are Vietnam and Laos. Jonathan Josephs, BBC News.